so about maybe uh, more than half a year ago I show you guys this little puppy I don't know if you guys remember him but uh, he was a little little puppy we got him four weeks in um, my girlfriend's friends uh, family couldn't really keep the dog for a while so they had to give away about three or four puppies um, but it was fairly young and yep, there he is right now. He's a terrier mixed with Pomeranian, I believe. Um, pretty smart dog. And people, come here. Come on. Come over here. You're going to be on YouTube. Come here. Wow. And every time you film them, they act up. So, <gasps> What's wrong? You want to give him to Bambi? Hey, yeah, I'll focus. I'm gonna focus you back. This is on auto. I hate auto lens. I mean, here you go, Bebo. There <whistles> he is. Bebo. Bebo. Up, 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 up. All right, he's lazy. Later, guys. What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel, Sneak On Feed 360. I actually had to mess around with the camera setting for a little bit before I could get this nice shot for you guys. Um, actually, it's not that much of a nice shot anyways. Just me exaggerating. Um, but we do have the DSLR camera. I'm taking full advantage of it. I'm trying to film as much as I can. Um, anyways, today we're back to show you guys yet another review. But this time it's not going to be a sneaker, it's not going to be a wardrobe, it's not going to be about um, gadget, electronic, uh, and any of that. Um, it's just something that I ordered maybe a week ago and a week ago and a week ago and a week ago and it came back. It came in, it arrived, and um, as I was actually cutting through it, I was like, how about I show you guys a video, you know, that'd be cool. So here we are. Um, uh, first things first. Um, I was actually gonna film in a lighter sh a setting. I have a big ass window, which traps off the heat because the sun comes up from the west. Um, Shoot, gotta turn off the heater. But my my um my window is actually facing the west, so therefore when the sun comes up, uh, it freaking shines and like, all the heat get captured inside, and it's freaking hot right now. But I gotta deal with the lamp, so um, bear with me for that. I'm gonna cut this open. I thought I haven't shown you guys an unboxing video for a long time, so you know why not now? Stay tuned for the channel. We actually got a another pickup coming. It's gonna be a shoe pickup. Um, I can't tell you guys more, so you just keep checking back with the channel. Hopefully next time I have my brother film, so that way we don't have to do with like all the you know mysterious angle and whether or not you know but these are awesome man look how they came in in a box and the way they packaged them it's just simple and pretty neat okay so what I have here this is the receipt real okay, I'll show you guys this is actually from M King uh, I'm not sure what season this is, but I hope this is the current season. I'm not sure. Um, but they were pretty cheap, you know, and I love I'm King. And it's sad to say that, I'm not going to say that they fell off, but I'm just going to say that not much people have love and support for them. Or the owner is actually doing something else, you know, that after this ice cream with another... Um, owner collaborating and whatnot, but um, I still have love for I'm King. A uh, little bit of history about I'm King. The owner is Andy Wynn. He uh, originally went to LQ, La Quinta High School. If you're familiar with Orange County, um, it's down by McFadden and Brookers or McFadden and Ward. And I went there for four years from 04 all the way to 08. And we happens to be in the same computer graphic class, Miss Mai. Um, but he was in there way earlier than me, of course. 
Uh, sorry, you guys. I'm freaking sweating right now. It's hot in here. But anyways, we got two beanies. Uh, probably one of them I'm going to end up giving to my girlfriend. So she's laying on, she's, <laughs> she's laying on bed. She's like, ah. She just got her wisdom tooth removed. So, um, yeah. So right here, one of them, the black one, and this one. I'm going to take out my hands. Free. So here we have it, you guys. I have to actually take another shot. Um, got to turn on my lights, you know, focus on staying like towards this angle a little bit more than moving back to here because back here is kind of far away, okay? As you can see, I'm blurry. And over here, it's just perfect. Anyway, so we got the hat. Um, this is the navy colorway. I hope that the focus of the camera is going to be able to capture everything. This is a navy on navy. As you can see right here, I'm king. Short for imaginary kingdom or later just change it to I'm king. Um, actually, navy on navy stitching. And then you got your uh, same color bill matching navy throughout the whole entire hat. Um, in the back we have a little tab going on that says I'm King in white and the tag is actually in black. And then you got your Oscar, the logo. Um, when you flip sideways it's pretty interesting. It actually says the word IK right there, I and the letter K. And then underneath the hat we have just navy and then uh, pretty much the logo and um, the slogan for raw talent. And then I'm king.com as you can see on the inside of it. We got a green bill going on. Um, super dope hat for just ten dollars. I'm just gonna take out my Cleveland hat real quick. Um, all you Cuddy's fans out there, peep that. And um, I'm just gonna put it on you guys. I'm just gonna throw that on there. You guys check it out. This is what the hat comes with. Pretty much just flat bill. And whenever we have a flat bill, what I end up doing is I end up bending them just slightly a little bit like that. Not too much, but just bend it like this at first a few times. Should be able to mold it onto your head. What I do is this. And if you notice, if you wear a hat for a while, all that sweat gets in there, your hair gonna get broken down. It's gonna mold to your head and it's gonna look perfect. It's gonna look like that hat belongs to you. You know what I mean? Pretty, um, pretty straightforward. Same thing for leather shoes, this and that. So front view of the hat. We got right side of the hat left side of the hat on the back of it okay um so now we're moving on to the next item we have the um i believe this is the gray on the receipt it says um yeah gray wrap and this is actually strap back and the um the logo is supposed to be strap backed but for some reason they sent me snapback so I don't know if I should send that back or something I don't even know we'll see um, a little introduction about I'm King I support the brand because they're locally um, I have a couple I'm King item here and there but it's sad to say that they are like I don't want to just say that they're going out of business you know what I mean but recently I guess the owner Andy Nguyen he's been um, busy with Absters ice cream. If, if you haven't heard of that, go check that out. Super dope ice cream with some milky buns. Um, he's actually doing that with Scott, um, the the just joint owner stuff like that. So he might get back to I'm King or not. I'm not sure. But I follow the I'm King Instagram as well as his, and then I found a sale on the website. Ten bucks for a hat, five bucks for a beanie. Why not? You know. So we have the hat. Um, Everything just gray, you know what I mean? Just gray throughout the whole entire hat. Kind of like a fusion between um, a wool, very, very thin layer of wool mixed with canvas. You can see the canvas pattern right there. Hopefully the camera is going to focus in on that. And we have white wrapped stitching. And on the back we have white Oscar with the uh, black synthetic leather. Pretty soft, pretty thin leather. Um, very tolerable. Um, on the other side we have the uh, reverse leather right there or, or invert you can see right here on the inside just some white um, white you know snake skins pattern and uh, same thing just raw I'm King raw talent I'm King.com ventilation holes up here and I have a feeling that this is gonna be great so I'm gonna go ahead and throw them on my head right now Wow, they feel, they feel flawless, man. They feel good. 
they feel awesome. So front view of the hat, right side. I've been having a lot of problems today, so I actually have to keep cutting the video. So hope you guys bear with me for a little bit. Um, so as I was saying, we we going on to this gray one right here. We have the strap back and leather. Um, they feel good. They feel soft. You know, this is how I would wear them, kind of like this. Yeah. And they're soft. That's just they're nice. You know. And now we're looking at the other one, the uh, logo. Uh, the shadow or whatever this is what they call shadow um, gray navy navy with gray speckles or cement speckle whatever you want to call it white on king logo you can see and this is how they look and I will bend them I bend them maybe about this much angle Let's see what here same thing you guys uh, snap back once again and there you have it. Alright, so uh, I'm going to put on two beanies. Probably I'm going to give the black one to my girlfriend. Because she likes black better than the gray one. And for some reason, I'm able to pull off the gray better than the black. So, there's that. But I'll show you guys the black one real quick. Um, like that. If it's cold, I would wear it like this. You know, covering the ear and stuff like that. But if it's not that cold and I just want to wear it then I kind of kind of put it up here you know? a lot of people will wear it like this but yeah um, now moving on to the gray one just a simple gray um, not a big fan of the big cuffing right there I guess we could move it down a little bit but you know the things about them folding it and then ironing it out so it's kind of making it inconvenient if you kind of roll them down a little bit but we have black logo with the white I'm king same thing sometimes I wear them like this <laughs> sometimes you know I um sometimes like this sometimes like this but yeah that's it um thanks for watching you guys make sure you guys rate comments and subscribe uh, check out my other videos if you haven't I actually we actually got another pickup coming up make sure you guys stay tuned on the channel I can't give that out to you guys yet I haven't posted anything on Instagram either but if you follow my brother's Instagram which is JJYAYJZ my friend just actually texted me congratulating me on you know copying that particular items which I will show in the next video um, hopefully it comes home on time hopefully everything goes out good uh, we got it from Europe, maybe in Australia, I'm not sure, or maybe Europe, I'm not sure. But hopefully it comes, everything works out good, and then we'll be able to shoot a video for you guys. Um, once again, it's not on my Instagram, I'm not going to post it, but my brother already did. Um, so check that out. And thanks again for watching you guys, make sure you guys rate, comment, and subscribe. If this is your first time on the channel, do me a favor you guys, click that subscribe button. You know how it is with YouTube. You know how the YouTube games works. The more subscribers I have, the more likely we are to be motivated to make more videos. Because how can we make videos if we don't have that much of an audience to begin with? So it is thanks to you guys for giving me that push, for giving us that push to continue making videos until this moment. So um, I truly, you know, appreciate you guys for all that. And uh, stay tuned to the next video once again. Rate up. Thumbs up, like, whatever they call it nowadays, and I'll see you guys. Let me show you guys someone real quick. Sorry, I filmed forever. You remember? Remember people? Give me a kiss. mad at me anyways uh this is the same puppy in that video that vlog uh if you go back a couple of video he was actually four weeks old and now he is how old is he now babe seven months eight months ten wait what eleven he's eleven months his name is Beepo the Terrier mixed with maybe Pomeranians.
Say bye, people. Bye. People, come here. Put you on camera real quick. Make sure you uh, head over to Amking.com. Check out the website. Check out the sale. Um, make sure you guys rate, comments, and subscribe. Check out my other video if you haven't. If this is your first time on the channel, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up or a like, whatever they call it now. And uh, subscribe to the channel for future video. If you guys remember people from previous video, give me a kiss.